Well, Jeff, federal authorities say since the gang was formed here in L.A. over 30 years ago, MS-13 is now one of the most significant threats to public safety in L.A. We're here at Whitsett Fields Park in North Hollywood, where authorities say gang members killed a homeless man. The federal indictment alleges a series of vicious murders, some involving machetes, knives, and baseball bats. On Tuesday, federal and local authorities announced nearly two dozen people associated with the most violent arm of the MS-13 gang in Los Angeles have been indicted on charges that include racketeering and murder. The gang is believed to have killed 24 people over the past two years. Prosecutors said in one murder, several MS-13 members drove a rival gang member to the Angeles National Forest because they thought he had defaced their graffiti. Six defendants hacked into death with a machete. The victim was dismembered and one of the defendants allegedly carved out his heart before throwing the body parts into a canyon. The indictment focuses on a subset of MS-13 known as the Fulton Click, which operates in the San Fernando Valley. Prosecutors say members killed a homeless man living at Whitsett Fields Park in North Hollywood, an area once controlled by the Click. The reason? To get into or climb up the ranks in the group. Mostly the majority of the gang in Fulton is mostly teenagers. This teen who doesn't want to be identified lives near the park and tells us he sees the gang's presence in his neighborhood. Because it gets heated in the streets. It gets, it gets, it's, it's crazy. Like you hear gunshots at night. You, it's where most of the things happen. Authorities say the clique targeted rival gang members and those they thought were cooperating with law enforcement. More stunning, however, was the violence visited against neighborhood residents and innocent bystanders. Distribute narcotics prey upon local communities through extortion and other crimes. They jump you for like money or anything like that. It's, it's a scary feeling. It feels like they're really going to do something to you. But now authorities want this indictment to send a message to MS-13 that savage violence and brutality will not be tolerated in L.A. 16 of the people charged in connection with their murders are eligible for the death penalty if prosecutors decide to seek it. Reporting live tonight in North Hollywood, Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News.